This is I've Got Scars, baby. As a man, yes, I wanted, I had to bring it on because I'm like, if I wonder if it looks a little different finding balance as a man in this society because society right now, a lot of times, unfortunately, men are not necessarily encouraged to share their emotional selves, uh, to even explore their emotional selves. And if they do explore it, whatever comes out, it's almost like it needs to be aggressive or it needs to be, a, you know, a certain way. It, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's almost like men, sometimes it feels like it's put in a box. Like if you're, if you can't just come around crying and you know what I'm saying? Like typically, and obviously that's not every man's experience, but a lot of times, you know, men just aren't encouraged to connect with themselves emotionally. So when we're talking about balance or being off balance as a man, maybe off balance, what, what does that look like in, in, in a man's world? Wow, Auntie, that's a huge question, but to zoom in and um, kind of break it down or to reverse engineer it on um, what that looks like in a man's world, you know, to be off balance mm -hmm. is um, when, um, you know, you're um, basically embracing more masculine than feminine, right? Because, mm -hmm. you know, that's the duality, right? Um, what a lot of men do not know is that men, we have wounds as well. You know, um, a woman um, has a wound that is very known and she has a cycle, you know, every month, right? And then she's able to purge, she's able to cleanse a lot of toxins and a lot of things, uh, right? But the cycle is to um, prepare her for birth. And when that doesn't happen, she's able to cleanse. For men, right? Mm -hmm. We don't have a quote unquote physical clock that's gonna automatically cleanse us. So we have to be able to tap into the things that's going to purge and cleanse the necessary toxins out of our bodies, right? So if a man is not doing this type of work, right, um, he will be off balance, you know, he would be operating from a place of ego, from a place of aggressiveness, from a place of um, not really able to embrace um his feminine side right because men are women we're 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 both right is which one would you tap into and i feel that when a man is able to be gentle he then becomes a gentle man so it's often like if you see an iron fist inside of a silk glove that's what i um um you know encourage men to become iron fists inside a silk glove. That way you can hold your daughter hand and walk her to the park. You can open up the door for not just your lady, but any lady that's coming behind you. Mm -hmm. Therefore, you can walk a sister to the car without asking her for a number, right? You can mm -hmm. just do these things. Why? Because they should be done, right? Yeah. So he can remove himself from that energy of macho, you know, yeah, I'm the man and really just be right you don't have to announce your manhood right manhood is something that just is and when you embrace what is the world will feel that vibration and it's like well wow, it's a man in the room you ever felt like that you're in a room full of people yeah you don't really feel that it may be males in the room but you don't feel that masculine energy no i when you come in the room the room knows like hmm Mm -hmm. room. And, and that safety, that security, that, yes. that, that um, it, it's just beautiful. I could go on and on about it, but I will say this. Ooh. Frederick Douglass once said, it's easier to build strong children rather than repairing broken men, right? Mm -hmm. So um, I feel that when you um, do this work as a man, um, you do both. You can um, build strong children, strong young boys to be men, and yeah. you can repair yourself, right? Yeah. So that's what this work is, you know, and it's an inside job. Manhood wow. is an inside job.